from Giants wide receiver Homer Rhino Jones spiking a football in the end zone for the first time in 1965 to Terrell Owens signing a football with a Sharpie. Touchdown celebrations have always been a source of entertainment and controversy. At one point, things got so out of hand that in 2006, the NFL amended its rules to impose an automatic 15-yard penalty and possible fines on players who left their feet or used props like a towel, the goalpost, or engaged in vulgar moves during touchdown celebrations. This is a look at the craziest banned touchdown celebrations in NFL history. Yo is the Michael Jordan of touchdown celebrations. From popcorn to pom-poms, this entire video could focus solely on Terrell Owens' iconic moments, starting with one of his wildest. It was week four of the 1999-2000 season, and T.O.'s 49ers were facing Dallas, their hated rival, and were winless after the first three games. It was one of those must-win games that no player or coach would outwardly admit, but everyone knew the stakes. Owens delivered, catching two touchdowns in a 41-24 victory for the 49ers. However, it was his post-touchdown actions that everyone remembers. He put the ball down, and George Teague leveled him. Teague, who later said he'd do it again if he had the chance, didn't face fines for Owens' most famous celebration, but T.O. was for others, like the memorable Sharpie incident. When Terrell Owens pulled a Sharpie out of his sock, and signed the football he caught for a touchdown, it was clear the NFL would never be the same. On the other side, the 49ers took the lead. As expected, the suits at the No Fun League were not amused, leading to a new rule resulting in immediate ejection for any player with a hard foreign object on their body. One big winner in all of this was Newell Brands, the owner of Sharpie, capitalizing on the notoriety of the moment. 